Hello. In this video I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called adding rational expressions with common denominators and GCF factoring. We're asked to subtract these two fractions and as you can tell we already have a common denominator. They're both written over 6a so when we do this subtraction we would always keep that denominator 6a here and in the numerator we would just have the first subtract the second so we're just going to go from left to right across the top so we would have 11a minus 2 subtract 7a and from here we could simplify and simplifying in the numerator here this 11a and the minus 7a those are like terms so we can combine those the 11a minus 7a would give us a 4a and we still have the minus 2 in the numerator and of course we still have our denominator of 6a but as was suggested in the title the greatest common factor in our numerator we have this 4a minus 2 we can take out a common factor both of those expressions 4a and 2 have a 2 that we could factor out so if I were to factor out a 2 from 4a I would be left with a 2a and if I were to factor out a 2 from the minus 2 that would leave me a minus 1 so you could think of this as the opposite of distribution if we were distributing this 2 back out this would give me the 4a that I started with and this would give me the minus 2 and now that we've factored out the greatest common factor there is an additional step of simplifying that we can do because if we have a common factor in the top and the bottom we can cancel common factors so in this case both the top and the bottom are divisible by 2 2 goes into 2 once and 2 goes into 6 three times so rewriting this fraction in the top I've canceled that 2 that I factored out the 1 times 2a minus 1 is just going to be 2a minus 1 and the denominator I've canceled the 6 to make it a 3 and the a is still there so 3a is my denominator I've simplified this now as much as possible 